Sage Wonder here. Um, so, yeah, I don't know if you've heard, but it's breaking news that uh, North Korea fired another ballistic missile. This report is uh, coming out uh, from South Korea. They say the uh, missile was fired uh, from the South Pyongyang province and uh, it headed east. So we don't know whether this is going to fly over Japan, whether this is going to be, you know, one of these days, one of these tests isn't going to be a test. It's going to be an attack. What better way to lull us to sleep, to sleep than to fling missiles so regularly that we start ignoring it? But uh, I'm just, you know, I made this video to hip you to this and let you know this is happening right now. You know, it could be headed our way as far as we know. But... Um, we're waiting for more information at the time of this uh, video today at uh, looks like 11:36 a.m. on Pacific time. So, um, yeah, that's the right time. Um, so, but my question is, when are we going to do something? We we supposedly have all this anti-missile uh, missile technology and lasers. When are we going to shoot one of these down out of the sky and show this guy that we're tired of this and we're not going to put up with it anymore? I mean, why don't we take these missiles out? That's just a question I've been asking myself for the last three or four of these. You know, uh, he had some missiles that that he tried to fire a while back that, uh, you know, imploded on the on the launching pad, and I thought maybe we were doing it, but it turns out probably it was just uh, they were, you know, failures. But um, when are we going to do something? It just makes me nervous that he's flying these missiles around the globe, and sooner or later, he's just going to send one all the way on over. You know, how is he putting us to sleep with this? Is this one headed towards us? Well, that remains to be seen, but uh, heads up, keep your gas mask handy. Oh boy, here we go again.